grew up, how I got here, and some things that happened. And so I will not tell you any of the episodes that I told you in here. Funny things happen all the time. About three months ago, an Amish guy called Sunday afternoon, and yes, the Amish don't have telephone, but man, they know how to get a hold of me on my cell phone. Oh, no problem. Call on the cell phone. Doc, I have a man trying to have twins at the same time. Yeah, a big virgin on mare. He had been gone for about six hours because he was visiting his sixth grandchild that was born in the last six weeks. So he, you know, he was busy with his grandchildren. Comes home and here's the man. Two heads, four front legs hanging out. And of course they did. Been too long. And Diane was with me. I said, Diane, let's go. Well, we were living over there. It was probably almost 20 miles. We were there in about 10 minutes or less. And the man was down. And yes, you know, hey, the first thing I do is take my shirt off, as you can tell, because I don't want to get my clothes dirty. And I already had my knife in my hand. And the only thing he can do was cut the one in half, push it in, pull the big one out, cut the other half out. Ten minutes later, the man was standing up eating. That's my job. If I can't save everybody, at least I want to save the mom. And yeah, I do that. And I don't have I don't have to think, okay, how shall we do it now? How shall we no? Get her done. And that's not my sentence, but I can't say that. <laughs>